Hey, nerdlings. What up, nerdlings? Do you nerd for boxes? Because we got one! So we ordered something from Video Game Dust Sleeves. As you can see, they do some pretty awesome uh -huh. custom ones, We've too. We've ordered from them before. And show that spine. I love that. Yeah, so keep your games looking nice. They display nice on the shelf, keeps all that dust out of there. Again, they do customs. Yep. But they also do dust sleeves for uh, just, you know, typical games. Yes. So, for instance, what kind of game is this? That's a Famicom. Super Famicom. Exactly. What's it say on the side? Nothing. What's it say on the top? Nothing. Oh. What do I win? You know what? That's a pain. Yeah. By the way, it's Super Scope 6. <laughs> so I ordered some Super Famicom desk sleeves. Let's take a look. Look at that. This box is packed full. So, uh, first of all, it looks like they itemized everything that we ordered, Ooh, which is very list. nice. And, uh... Ooh, that looks pretty in there. I see some freebies on here. Uh-oh. So, look. Look at oh, they're individual. Man. Look at that. They are all wrapped, so they are not scratched up in shipping. Individually sealed, no less. As you can see, lots and lots of Super Famicom dust sleeves, but we also had a couple extras like... Let's get this out of the plastic. No! J-Love 81. Uh, you know what? You're going to have to leave a comment down below, J-Love, and let us know exactly which NES game needs to go in this dust sleeve. Ready? Ow! I, I felt that one. Ow! That hurt. <laughs> we also got another custom, Captain Algebra, and do it this on the back, love LJN, hate Wind Waker. <laughs> <laughs> So you know what game's going in there. Actually, I know exactly which game to put in here. Watch this. Ta-da! What else would you put in the caps, dust sleeve, but Super C? <laughs> you sure you don't want to put Wind Waker in there? It won't fit. That's not an NES. It's thing. okay. <laughs> so it looks like they set us oh. up with some nice Atari 2600 dust Those sleeves. Let's get the plastic off these. All right, so those <laughs> are awesome. Those are so cute. And did you see what it says on the back? It says, hey, nerdlings. That's so cute. You know, I honestly have never seen, oh, my favorite game, Cubert. I've never seen our logo vertical or horizontal before. It's actually not too bad. That's cute. Nice. Look at that. Look at that, that fit. Is that so is great. great. So now it keeps all the dust out of yes. there. Doesn't do anything to hinder that nope. end label on the carts that have end labels. So that is perfect. I actually really like this design with like just the logo just do 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 and then us. <laughs> That's so cute. And some more little freebies in here. Whoa, what out! Woo! Woohoo! And these. Ooh, whoa. 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 Sega Genesis. Nice. So let's try one of these out. All right. So uh, we got to check these out for the lady. Oh, Little Mermaid. <laughs> and hey, sometimes you've got a good game that uh, you want to make sure you're keeping the dust out of. So these slide in here like this. Now it does cover up that end label, but if you get the, uh, the typical label mm -hmm. design from the game and cover it, it's not going to matter. But I love these custom ones because yeah. they're so much fun. So look how easy it is to get your game out of there. It just slides right out. That's perfect. It's a nice, good fit. Yeah. But it doesn't feel like it's going to do yeah, anything see, to damage the cartridge or anything, like the label. Now, did you come up with this design? I did not. Oh, kudos to you. I really like that. I like that, actually. 
a lot better than just the plain back white background <laughs> of our dust sleeves. We may have to uh, change change up our design. Maybe so. Those will be the limited edition. Yeah, ones. these are limited edition. All right. Well, that was super incredibly nice of you to toss some uh, some freebies in there. Thank you so much, and they will be put to very good use. So yeah, now. Look at all of these beautiful Super Famicom ones. That is so cool. Let's get some games in these. That's when you need to push yourself to the test and show us the passage of time. We're gonna need a montage. We want to take a montage. All right, so let me just say video game dust sleeves helps you turn this into this. Look at how much wow. nicer that looks. Now they all have spines, so you can put them on the shelf and know exactly what game you have without having to do like that cheap old little label maker label that I had on some of those from before. And the sides, you have nice side spines like that. I mean, they just look really, really good. They really add that color to mm -hmm. it. They really pop now on the shelves instead of just having those gray carts. And one last time, they're protected from dust, yep. which is awesome. And then you've got, you know, your front cover and your back cover. You found some little yeah, extra bits. Yeah, they were bits. hidden in one of the thingies. We got cute little things. There's like a little Pac-Man stickers, and would you say that's like a window decal? Nice. There's an alcohol prep pad so that you can put the window decal on there. So it looks like the Pac-Man are eating ghosts, and the ghosts say VGDS. Nice. That's very cute. So yeah, love that. All right, nerdlings. Please check out Video Game Dust Sleeves. Of course there is going to be a yes. link down in the description. And if you want to protect your games, if you want them to look nice on your shelves, hit them up. Think about the custom ones. Hey, yes. you can get some custom ones yep. of us or, or many other YouTubers, other YouTubers yeah. if you don't have your own custom design. But they look great. I I absolutely love them. I love this idea. The quality is always so good. Mm -hmm. They uh, It's like high quality print on all of them. They come obviously pre-assembled. They're packed nicely so that they're not getting yes. scratched up on the way there. So everything about them is absolutely wonderful. I cannot recommend them enough. And I can't wait to put these on the shelf. I know, so they it's look, gonna look awesome. so much better. Now, one last note. Um, I'm pretty sure this love of Dust Slaves started with Linda, yeah. a.k.a. Gamer Girl. She had a contest, and we won a game sleeve from her, and then we were like, hey, what, do, what is this? It's like, these are awesome. Yeah. And by the way, I've got Mylon Secret Castle, so Linda, if you want a different game in there, yeah, comment tell us down what below. Game, tell us which game yeah, needs to be Yeah, what game do you there. want in your Dust Sleeve? <laughs> All right, well guys, if you happen to like the video, please give it a like, and be sure to leave some comments down below what you think of these dust sleeves, uh, whether you like the typical ones that go off of the box art, the label art, or if you prefer the uh, the custom ones that look really awesome. And be sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell to see what's up, and please go over there to Video Game Dust yes. Sleeves and check out their work. And don't forget to like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram so that you can see those closer upper pictures, see what we're doing out and about in the real world, and to know when a video is dropped, because sometimes YouTube is just a jerk, and they don't let you know a video is dropped. <laughs> so, you know, also, we've got merchandise over there on TeePublic. We'd love to see you in our merch. Show us your pictures of your merch. Nerdlings, if we like it. We nerd it. For dust sleeves. Don't, don't, why? You're a toddler. Everything goes in your mouth. They look great, but they don't taste very good. <laughs>
ready? Yes, sir. <sighs> and face. Are you working? Dude, your package ceilings are amazing because I'm having a hard time getting into them. But now, look how easy it is yeah. to get your game right back out of there. It just slides out. Let's try that again. Nerdlings, please check out video... video. Jeez, what is wrong with me? I think because you want to call it Video Games Monthly. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Floyd! <laughs> Here comes the sun, little darling. There goes the sun, little darling. Because, Tom, what you can do is put Video Game Death Sleeve's logo right on the box. The scissors, like we're getting ready to open. Okay, not so crazy, though. <laughs> My eyeballs are drying out. Psst, it's not for you. <laughs> this is not the time to be testing me, Paul. 